everyone, this is Jane from TorontoShopaholic.com. Uh, today I am doing another denim review. Uh, this one is of the J. Crew matchstick jean. Um, I'm wearing it in a 32 short, which is the petite. Um, if you remember from the earlier review, uh, in the Gap denim, that is a um, size 30 or 10. So that's how the two companies' sizing differences. Uh, I'm basically in uh, a size up of the J. Crew denim. Um, now the matchstick jean is similar in that it is a slim, straight leg jean. Um, it fit, it's fitted through the thigh and uh, easy to tuck into boots. What I don't like about the J. Crew matchstick jean is um, how where they cut across. They are uh, a lower um, rise than the Gap denim. Uh, I would say they are about three fingers uh, below the belly button, maybe a little bit lower. Um, but basically it cuts across the widest part of me. Um, and because this is a heavier, not a soft denim, it, the waistband isn't as comfortable across where it's cutting. So if it was slightly higher rise, I would, I would be giving this jean uh, I guess a, a lot better review but uh, it fits great across the bum uh, through the leg I like the feel of the jean everywhere except for the waistband um, and I, I've noticed this with J. Crew, uh their cords as well I have a pair of their um, boot cut cords and it's the same thing they're a little bit lower in the rise. It cuts across um, the widest part of your hip, and if you're not a really don't have a boyish figure, it um, isn't the most flattering. So you have to be uh, more selective in terms of what top you're wearing with it. Um, you can't wear something slim over because you're trying to hide uh, any muffin top or what have you in terms of the jean fit. Uh, but like I said, the the leg line is really nice. They're great to tuck into boots. Now I got this in the over dyed black. It is actually a really dark, nice black jean. If you're looking for something that isn't faded and looks like it's totally washed out already, this is a nice um, a nice wash. So um, again, with the petite length, um, I am five four. They hit the floor. Um, I wouldn't have to hem them except that I would prefer them to be uh, about an ankle cut as opposed to hitting the floor and having like you know a little bit of extra uh, fabric. Um, if Even if I was wearing these with heels there would be a bit of bunching which is okay but I'd prefer them to be a little bit more tailored so even I would have to hem these a bit so if you're shorter than 5'4 Keep in mind that you're going to hem, uh, hem them, uh, but there's absolutely no whiskering or anything that you would have to be worried about in terms of um, style that you'd be losing. So it's actually another good one for petites that um, you could wear and tailor without losing what the jean is supposed to look like. Thanks again, and remember to log on to torontoshopaholic.com. Thanks.